we think about healthy eating, people are looking for what's easy, and prepackaged salads seem like a home run. But our next guest got the runs like you've never seen before. Check out this cautionary tale. I have been eating these salads exclusively for months, and I want to tell you why you should not eat these without washing them first. So throughout my entire life, I've always struggled with eating disorders. Through therapy, I've learned that I can definitely still love my body while eating healthy and just making sure that I pay attention to what's going into my body. So now I'm a mom with three boys, and it's been really difficult to find healthy foods that are quick and easy. It was awesome when I went to the grocery store and I was able to find these prepackaged salads that were quick and easy and seemed healthy. So this salad diet that I was on went on for about two to three months. About a month and a half in, that's when the stomach pain started getting really bad. At first, the pain started as cramping and kind of this sharp pain in my stomach. Like, I have to go to the bathroom so bad, but I might throw up. That's what was going on. So fast forward about another week, and I was at my son's basketball game, and this urge came on where I got super sick. So I'm rushing to the bathroom. The color is drained out of my face. My stomach just hurts so bad. I'm not religious, but I was like praying, please, dear God, like make this pain go away. So after being on the toilet with this super intense pain, I was finally done. When I looked in the toilet and I saw what looked like a big ball of spaghetti, it took me off guard because I hadn't eaten any spaghetti. And then I realized, oh my God, these are worms. Well, Jackie joins us now from her home in Montana. Hi. Jackie, wow, wow. Jackie, Jackie, worms, <laughs> worms. How many were we talking? Uh, I mean, there were way too many to count. It was really just a nightmare. <laughs> it was oh, so Jackie, the, we heard your backstory came from South. When the infectious disease doc got involved to analyze the worms, tell us what his reaction was. Um, I think that I was his version of Christmas morning. I know that sounds good. <laughs> you know, I live up here in Montana, so things like this are pretty rare um, for us to have. Um, he knew that it was a really bad infestation that I had um, because uh, the amount that I had expelled. Um, and he's told me these ones are all dead. So you're going to see a, there's a lot more inside. Oh, now, Jackie, clearly you needed some immediate medical treatment and so I want to know did you go to the hospital did you go to the clinic what exactly did you have to do I actually called my doctor the day that I saw it um, actually from the bathroom I called him and um, he was like you need to be seen pretty much immediately come in as okay. soon as you can so I went straight to my my doctor's office and um, the treatment was actually really simple it was just three pills that all that I had that was all that I had to take um, it was gonna be really simple fast um, every time I went to the bathroom, there was, there was a lot of worms for a few days. And then within about three to four days, I actually struggled. I had no more stomach pain. There were no more worms. Um, I was really anemic, so that took a while. Um, but other than that, I mean, I felt, I felt a lot better after doing the treatment. 